Hi, this is Alex, and this is MTB Riley with Jesus. Today is a new video, my first video on this channel. So I'm so excited. This is a particularly because of my sport. Because my sport, we think about going to the mountains, having a good time and enjoying expressions and you know giving out praises to everyone but i never i never hear anybody um talking about god bless you bro or um may may god be with you and i could relate let me pray to you let me pray for you let us pray. And I never see that in our bike, mountain bike community. And I know it's a sport. And I know it's there are different backgrounds and different religions. And they don't want to hear something like that. But I encourage you to do it. It's not it's not it's not being shamed for anything. It's it's our duty because we're disciples. We have to give the word to every creature. And um, I was truly enough um, happy that I shared this to a lot of people, even in the mountains, you know, after we we done our uh, little ride and we're kicking back, enjoying it, drinking our water relaxing and um and it was it was great you know i left a seed on that person's and um i i hope that god grows the seed and it's not a i just encourage people just just go ahead and 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 and, and do it It feels really good to to actually help or listen to their problems or what's going on in their head and you know what's clearing because our therapy is our mountain mountain bikes that's our therapy I understand that completely but what's gonna happen after it's gone there's not gonna be no way to stopping it you are still gonna have that problem so I would like to leave a little bit of encouragement before I, I, I actually um, uh, go down the hill and uh, have a good time. And um, I say, well, God bless you, bro. And um, God be with you. Ride safe. And today that's happened. And it was great. But also... It's about the good book. And today's good book is the Bible. Today I got I have to we're gonna study the book of Acts. The book of Acts was written by Luke, right before Jesus Christ has died. And uh, he was he was writing all the information and all the all the witnesses and everything was going on. And um, what we're gonna read is Acts chapter four, verse twelve. Uh, this is regarding Peter being in imprisonment because he's, he actually did a miraculous miracle by the power of Jesus Christ. And um, he, there was a lame man in the temple and he was, he was lame for 40 years. And this man was, was given the gift to get up and walk by Peter, by the by the Holy Spirit, by Jesus Christ. And uh, he was walking and, and, um, and the Pharisees heard about that and they took him to prison. They got beaten and everything. And this is what Peter was so like, like every man will probably be out of line and started screaming and yelling and, but not Peter. Peter, what he did 
was so beautiful. And it reads, And there is salvation in no one else, for there is no other name under heaven given among men by which we must be saved in Jesus Christ. Your salvation is not mountain biking. Your salvation is not any other religion you chose to. I don't write the mail. I deliver. And I understand that you have different types of religions and different types of Zen or whatever. And it's that's not the way to go. Because the Bible is one of the most interesting factual books. And it's factual. And it's not fake. It's real. And I hope if you can look at Acts chapter 4 verse 12, you will totally understand why we should rely on Jesus Christ and only Him to the order to be saved. And I love you very much. Whoever's listening to it or whoever's watching this, I would like to give my love to all of you. And may the grace and mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you. And I hope the next time I see you in the trails, I hope you're saved. Because if not, God will lead me to you. And I hope I put that seed. And God will grow it.